आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ so the students in this question we have to find the mean deviation about the median of the data given to us x y values are given as 15 21 27 30 and 35 and their corresponding frequencies are given as 3 5 6 7 and 8 okay to find it first we have to calculate the median so first we have to arrange this value in increasing order values of x y but it is already set in increasing order okay students so i can write this as it is 15 21 Twenty-seven, then thirty, and then thirty-five. Okay, so and so then we have to write their corresponding frequencies. Okay, their corresponding frequencies are three, five, six, seven, and eight. Then we have to find the cumulative frequencies. Okay, what cumulative frequency? So, which which is three? Three plus five will give me eight. Eight plus six will give me fourteen. Fourteen plus seven will give me nineteen. Nineteen plus eight will give me what? Wait a minute. Fourteen plus seven will give me twenty-one. Okay. Twenty-one plus eight will give me twenty-nine. So there are total twenty number, twenty-nine number of data. Okay. So I can write n, or I can say sigma of f i is equal to twenty-nine. Okay. So we have to find the median. We have to look up. This is odd. This is odd number of terms. Okay, so we have to look n plus one divided by two term. Okay, which is my twenty nine plus one divided by two, which will be equal to fifteen term. Fifteenth term. Okay, will be my median. Okay, see, fifteen is greater than fourteen. Okay, so my fifteen term will be this thirty. Okay, so what will be this thirty? Whose cumulative frequency is just greater than fifteen? Okay, so this thirty will be my median. Okay, wait a minute. Let me write here. So my median. Let me represent this by capital M. Okay, is coming out to be what equal to thirty. Okay, now what I need to do? I need to first calculate x i minus m because we are calculating mean deviation about median. So we have to calculate this value first. Okay. M we have found to be thirty. Okay, so fifteen minus thirty will give me minus fifteen. Twenty-one minus thirty will give me minus nine. Twenty-seven minus thirty will give me minus three. Thirty minus thirty will give me zero, and thirty-five minus thirty will give me five. Okay. Now we have to write what we have to write the its mod value. Okay, absolute value. So this is fifteen, nine, three, zero, and two. Now to calculate this mean deviation, we have to calculate one more term, which is x i minus m into f i product of this term into frequencies. Okay, so fifteen into three will give me what? Will give me forty-five. Now nine into five again give me forty-five, and this three into six will give me eighteen. Zero into seven will give me zero, and two. Wait a minute. This is five. Okay, not two. This is five. Okay, mod of five is five. Five into eight will give me forty. Okay, now we have to sum them up. Okay, sum these values. So it will be five plus five ten eighteen. One five nine ten fourteen. Okay, so it is coming out to be one forty eight. Okay, now I have to apply my formula for calculating mean deviation. See so mean deviation. deviation about median about capital m is defined as sigma of xi minus my median value into this fi sigma of this divided by my sigma of fi okay so this will be equal to this we have found to be 148 and sigma of fi we have found to be 29 what to be equal to 29 okay friend And one forty eight divided by twenty nine approximately equal to what? Is equal to this five point one zero. Okay, so that will be my answer. So hope you understand. Thank you. Class six to twelve से लेके NEET, IIT, JEE, mains और advanced के level तक दस million से ज़्यादा students का भरोसा. आज ही download करें doubt net app या WhatsApp कीजिए अपने doubts आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर.